leap across like one roof that is barely separated and you can get out. All right. Yeah. Um, I, I know someone, so there's a, I got to talk to the captains, but there's someone who I would like to bring on board to help uh, logistically get it started with like mm. staffing and fitting it out with what it's going to need. Cause they used to work there a long time ago and they were pretty well respected. Yeah. Uh, and I kind of want to just take them there to have a look around as is, and then get their thoughts on what they think, needs to be remedied as far as layout does that uh does that seem all right uh yeah uh, they can have like their opinion on layout but they might not be how it's going to be like i think okay i think getting rid of any possibility of leaving the area is probably the first and then we can kind of yeah, yes there. definitely definitely preventing them from being able to walk out would be number one yeah okay all right no problem i just want to make sure yep no you're good all right cool I feel like I'm going to bring that up. Let's get rid of the prison and bring back the pit. Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> the pit. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, yeah, you're not wrong. I ain't going to fuck around if that's the case. Uh oh, see, so things can also get thrown into Bolingbroke. Yeah. There's a few ways to go uh, to fix that. Uh, I, I need to ask internally where we are with the prison. Because I think it's a, it's a balancing thing where we are not focusing on it, maybe, because it's not a big deal, because a lot of people don't go to prison. But also, people shouldn't be running into the towers and then throwing themselves off the fucking side. Like it's also using using your brain kind of thing rather than just because you can shouldn't doesn't mean you should do it. You know. Let me get some water while we wait. It's fail RP, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ah, Typing responses already. That's right. Mm -hmm. Guaranteed, out of all the things that we do, that's going to be the one thing oh, remembered yeah. by everybody. <laughs> Even McNulty, that's a cop, just sitting there. Like, oh, yeah. I feel like that's the best thing I'm going to bring to the table. That's a good one. <laughs> I, I don't think anyone could disagree with that. We're just a city that moves very fast, and uh, 35 is not it. Uh, Crane, question. Yeah. MDT access. 
Is that just for you and the mayor, or is that something we can oh, ask? For? Everyone will be getting access. Uh, I got to sit down and just set it all up. Okay. All right. I just that's why I it. got your guys' info that I emailed you about. Oh. Um, but I'm working with the technician, and I think he just put in the categories for city council documents and state announcements. So I'm going to create a uh, staff job uh, tied to your guys' access that gives you access to those as well as uh, the penal code. Sound good. They would order. Response Just finished again. updating all the uh, fines for the other moving violations. So, I'll uh, I'll address this the city council and BT access after the meeting. Kind of want to twad. You're welcome. Right. Somebody was asking this earlier. Like, two terrorists. I feel like Mick and Nick are... Uh, not Mick and Nick. Max and Nick... Uh, Mi Max and Michael are pretty much aligned. He's very much a criminal, but he's against dumb fucking criminals. Lazy criminals. And Michael is the same. That's why, like, going and I guess going against the grain knowledge is Tongva and putting shit like this out there and getting like fucking country. people that are dumb is fine. Uh, the roads that I would consider country roads are Joshua, Route 68, and Sustancia. Okay, thank you. The way that I I typically look at it is they are uh, Wait, what relatively is... even elevation uh, two lane roads without a divider. Okay. Outside of city limits. That makes sense. I didn't know we had a fucking... Tongva, I think, <laughs> is a bit too dangerous to be going... Uh, yeah, it's a mountain. Very 75 low. consistently yeah. on. It's like up or down good, hill. Good, it's good, good. That's what I always considered it going? still it's in city because it's paved. Drawing personally. out a little bit, <laughs> like, but it's yeah. good. Have you guys seen the what? What is... Oh yeah. Oh, yeah <laughs> that's really what I was like that. that's what I said. It's like no matter God what we do, the government. <laughs> that's yep, gonna be the one thing that we're remembered for. Someone Absolutely. was like someone mentioned um what did they say? They said best mayor or something like that, and I just wanna be like, this was a council decision. This was a me thing. I did this. This was uh, yeah, everyone to thing. To realize that things are a lot different, but you know, so they'll, they'll get there hopefully. Someone said thank you, Mr. Mayor, and the rest of the council. Is Basically. Michael in the Civ arc? He's been in the Civ arc for a long time. And then someone uh, someone twatted out G6 smashing at 55 past some more buns as if they're not already doing that and worse. But now they could be charged more for it. That's good. I mean, I'm unironically seeing those guys like drift their huge trucks around. Oh the yeah. So it's it's ridiculous right now. I'm pretty sure. Little bitch arc. Shut the fuck up, Simo. So you little like, bitch ass. Probably just like slap a bunch of ushers in it too. Yep. Yeah. Probably. That'll be break. We'll do it. I return. Apologies. Oh, you're good. How do we go? Uh, so, uh, what was the general consensus on mutual combat? We were fine with it in the courtroom under judicial supervision. Okay. Because um, one of the objections was that they didn't want to burden the cops, and I said, fuck it. I already allow it in my courtroom. Why not just offer the judges the opportunity to entertain it or not? So, if a judge entertains it, you bring the other guy to City Hall, you say, we want to fight, we want to do it safely without liability. Judge calls down an EMS. Um, you know, gets their consent verbally, hits the gavel, they fight, and that's the end of it. Um, and this doesn't have like pertain to like a, an actual court case, it's just like literally. No, they just okay, okay. It's just like open court, and I and I think a really good benefit of it is is the metal detectors mean that nobody's gonna cheat and pull out a knife or a gun or whatever. Oh, All that's right. a good point. Yeah, perfect. So, uh, um, go on, on to, to add on to that, I don't know if this is something we want to add now or just address it as can. But you mentioned like MMA. Like I, I think if it's under a 
licensed business where that's their speciality. I mean, I think it should be allowed then too, but that may be a, a bridge we cross when it comes. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Uh, the thing yeah. is, the pit is not going to work. Um, Fuck. You're going to send off. Anyone else think jujitsu is lame? <laughs> You know what I'm yeah, I mean, about? if I wanted to wrestle a man, I would have, you know, been born gay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> word. <laughs> or, or by sex. Or by sex. Yeah, hey, you know, whatever you're into, but not my thing. Fair enough. Um, okay, <laughs> so uh, would that be a... Where would we plug that into the uh, current legislation? Uh, shit, I don't know. Uh, would we just toss in the legislation section of the, uh, the MDT? Oh, as its own thing, kind of like how you did with the, uh, speed limits? Uh, the alternative would be, uh, I, I don't know if it's too wordy, but you could just rework the uh, assault and battery definition, like, exemptions, if under judicial guidance or, or just something. I think we should make a uh, legislation announcement. Yeah, I think we need a specific entry for mutual combat. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, do you want me to draft it up, Mr. Crane? Or would that would you like... be very helpful. Okay. Easily done. I will get that done today. Cool. Uh, next, uh, oh, oh, what was the vote on that, by the way? I think, oh, we're I think we actually it. voted. Yeah, unanimous, yeah, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And any nays? Excellent. I like this trend. I like how we're asking for any nays because we're so cooperative and working together right now. It's so it's a beautiful thing to witness. Yeah, I don't think anybody's really touching on anything too divisive yet. So I mean, yeah, I nobody's asked not... to murder each other yet. I love how we're <laughs> around in circles. Speaking yeah. of which, uh, the one child policy. Let's go, baby. Mm. I, I'm. I, uh, this is a uh, child of mine. I went ahead and shared it with you guys. A child uh, of yours? <laughs> yeah. Um, well, you better be ready to pay for that. This is just a, a brief uh, overview, but essentially, um, Los Santos has an incest slash adoption slash family tree epidemic. And uh, the purpose of the one child policy would be to null and void uh, officially any of these fraudulent adoptions and uh, it would furthermore establish the uh, the crime of adoption fraud. Uh, and it would also, um, and all of these I wanna... things are revenues for the state. Okay, so not only does it establish that stuff, <clears throat> it's going to provide the opportunity for people to officially uh, and state-recognize adopt uh, only one person. I will um, allow it. It would be if, for if the Michael price of twenty-five thousand dollars per adoption, twenty-five thousand dollars to unadopt, uh, and a fifty thousand dollars fine if someone is somehow uh, conv uh, convicted of adoption fraud. I don't know how you would get caught doing that. Uh, it's mainly just a big number to scare. I'm sure someone might be stupid enough to actually uh, outright incriminate themselves in that regard. Um, but that is the one-child policy to to kind of oh, curtail this. Uh, set weird societal you are reliable for your going kid. on for years as far as i'm aware question sure what if uh is, is there anything in there with liability like if you adopt somebody you're liable for their actions nope nope uh it literally just a certificate that says hey uh this you are adopted by this person uh congratulations that's could, it could we have that uh liability in what way it's your kit you're liable for oh. their actions to some degree. Well, so that that would that would be possible and a potentially good idea uh, if they weren't uh, adults. Fair, but but in 100 of occasions they are adults and oftentimes uh, extremely close in age. So it's it's a weird it's a weird thing. So um, there's there, there's a lot of questions with this. For example, um, like I'm all on board with this. Don't get me wrong. I just want to get the kinks out of the way. Mm -hmm. um, so you and I already discussed this wouldn't apply to siblings. You can't. Right. Yeah. The, okay. Okay. Yeah. So uh, blood relatives, um, this does not apply to at all, obviously, because it's not an adoption. You guys are related by blood. Does he want to be liable? What about you marriage relatives? Um, also allowed, I would say. I also have something on marriage I want to propose as well in a moment. But Luke, uh, go on, Juno. Um, so the other thing, fuck, what was it? Okay, age difference. 
So right. uh, the way that I, I have this playing out in my mind, so please feel free to intervene, is um, you'd obviously uh, people would apply for this and they, they'd uh, state their case and point to, to whoever it may be that will be in charge of this. I'm thinking a judge, obviously. Uh, let's say a 30-year-old wants to adopt a 29-year-old. Mm -hmm. It happens, though. I'm iffy on that. Okay. Age just doesn't make sense to me. However, if a 50-year-old wants to adopt no. a 25-year-old, that makes sense. You're... Because at the... Yeah. No, go on. Because at that point, it's like, okay, if you're attempting to adopt someone like a year or two younger than you, you might as well call yeah, that exactly. person your sibling rather than your kid, you know? Right. But that, um, yeah, that's just, that's just not how adoption works though, right? No. Yeah, exactly. I... Yeah. Um. So my thoughts on this, uh, I agree with you. It's fucking stupid. Uh, that mm -hmm. said, I think it's finally time for the, uh, the city of New Los Santos to really take advantage of that stupidity and to... Uh, uh, despite the um, minute age differences, mm -hmm. uh, to let it go through anyway, because uh, that's a twenty-five thousand dollar check for the state. Sure. You know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I guess I was thinking mm -hmm. that it would um, mm -hmm. you'd have to really prove your case in point to people, but I, I understand that aspect too. Yeah, uh, I, I, I don't much money for it. Why are we limiting it? Why not just like raking the cash? But People oh, you want you want to you want to up the price a little bit? I was I actually just thinking. Oh, like, like, unlimited like, children. Like, she's saying. Uh, yeah, like, oh, like just to pay. Someone wants just to yeah. have like a, five kids. <laughs> they can throw over hundred k. So yeah, day. but that's the thing though. If 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 people start adopting five kids, then I mean, you got to think about it this way. Double this it. city. What is it called again? In comparison, this double? island, this state, in comparison to other states, 50, is actually quite small. 100, Everyone is tied to one another in some way, and that's how you fuck up the family tree completely. Yeah. Uh, so, you know, obviously, uh, these ties, uh, you know, I used to run the streets uh, years ago. You know, I, I knew a lot of people. Uh, it, it provided a lot of exponential growth. Uh, what's the word? Uh, mudding of the waters insofar as, mm -hmm. you know, like, hey, you know, Johnny attacked Billy. But, you know, I know both of them, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, um, yeah. it, it's like a, it's like a, it's, in my life. It, it's like a societal issue, really. Um, this kind of helps it a little bit. Uh, and that's why I wanted to put a cap on it because we, uh, it, it kind of, um, so it, I, what's the best way to put this? I, I, I it just gets a bit absurd kind of, you know? Well, I, yeah. I, when you have somebody who's literally just like, Hey, hi, yeah. how are you? You're my kid. Can I challenge you? Know? And that, that has I happened. Can, well, that has fucking that, happened. That happen. I remember right. when, uh, when Bass passed away and I did his autopsy and viewing after, um, one of the, uh, contacts just said all of my children and you know how fucking hard it was well, it to try to figure out they were. There was yeah. Yeah. It doesn't prevent it or allow it, 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 it is to prevent people from doing the dumb shit of um, having as part of the adoption process, I was flirting with the idea of allowing people to uh, change their surnames. Uh, I don't Ooh. know how. I, yeah, I don't know how that would work on the back end. However, uh, so it might just completely gloss over that idea. I don't want. Yeah. I don't want. I don't. I don't want people's like records not being transferred yeah, over I'm, to I'm their new. I'm from a logistical standpoint. Yeah. Yeah, it, yeah it, I think that's I, why it's never really been entertained. I'll, I'll give you a much, comparison, Max. It's too much. Mm -hmm. uh, even though I have the judicial and uh, technical capability to do so in the MDT. Uh, I typically refer everyone who wants a name change to the federal government because I just don't think it's yeah. something we should be fucking with. Yeah, yeah. I, I I feel that. I, I was just letting you guys know that's what I was on. Ty uh, Nakoda. Tiger. So this is, uh, just to clarify, this is specifically for uh, a parental adopting a child, correct? Yeah. So what would stop someone from saying, uh, oh, we're brother and sister now, we're related? Um, good fucking point. Are, are you talking about, like, yeah. blood relative, or are you talking about, like, other... No, 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 I'm just talking about people doing the same exact thing that you're trying to God, curb, just... but just different, different relationship. We could, uh, so... That would still be, fo that would still be falsifying... I don't know the correct terminology for it, but it would still by? be. What, what a, about a like false. identity? We could call it identity fraud, right? Isn't that? Uh, then you're getting into dicey territory with what yeah. that constitutes legally. I think. I feel okay. like. 
we we could we could we could just call that adoption as well <laughs> you know then uh you know we uh would you guys do dna tests at the uh the hospital by chance two yeah, hours and 35 minutes so 34 mm -hmm. two minutes you do i have done that before yeah are those bad <laughs> we're always gonna get run into the issue that people can just instead of having be official which is like what you do by adopting and paying and then you can just, just say right. it they will just say that this is my kid like obviously right. but then you have the difference of people That's just saying it fine. versus versus it being official mm -hmm. am i allowed to um question why one why not two why why not allowed to have a sibling right I, I I see. I was I was thinking that I was thinking. Um, uh, why don't we start off with the one child policy, see how that goes, and also about I was, grandkids. I, well, I was also we were. To, I, I I raised that up as well. But with my with my train of thought, I was. Um, I really want to do this family tree. That is something that I can do in my own time. I can I can build up that document um that wouldn't be accessible to the public at all but it's a way to keep track and then coming back to it a little while later if this goes through and potentially adding another child to that so hey, hold on two child policy so you want to you want to am i following this right you want to gather everyone's information about who's related to who by blood or adoption and put it in like or a central document no, 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 it's for the DOJ, and if, uh, so for instance... Um, so you want the government to track who's who? A, not the PD, the DOJ. And right, the potentially, PD, the uh, There's the, no it, it, Potentially way the um, doctors as well, in case of an emergency. So they know who to contact in the case of an emergency. Uh, You're just going to have small clusters of, like, the, these people. Contact. Do you have uniforms planned? Huh. What? <laughs> yeah, that's uh, kind of. I know yeah, where you're going. Like, I know where you're going. I'm, I'm open to this discussion. That's why I've, I've tried to like lean so, into it a bit. But I don't think, as it stands, it's the. Best I have, one. I have a lot of feelings about this. Uh, partially because uh, my family is uh, not as, I guess, overabundant as uh, you know the late Sam Bass's Bush was, but um. Right. You know, like I have my brother, uh, Flop, who, you know, we are not blood related. Of course. Um, which we have, you know, officially adopted each other, you know, for many, many years. And, right. you know, then I have, although not officially, you know, a father daughter relationship, I do have my father figures, Richard Dark and Matt Rhodes. And, you know, they have officially taken flop as you know their child so and then they also had a son uh cody sharp who is no longer with us so was he dead? i now yeah, yes he, he, he passed oh yeah. uh, okay um now as far as like the age difference uh you know there's not a lot of an age difference between matt and i um, there is more of a significant one between Richard and I, so I don't like the the age restriction on. Oh, uh, that's, that's not going to be that's not going to be a thing. Yeah, um, that's telling but I, how I to do live get that's where you're thing. coming from as to why you feel it might be, you know, because people just randomly picking up strangers it, off the road and it, then it, claiming it, them is silly. It's societal erosion, right? It's but terrible. there are there are established families already that have built those bonds and have those relationships, and we shouldn't be messing with that. Counterpoint: well, You're if, saying if, there's if, good counterpoint. Ones? If those bonds mean so much to them, surely they'd be willing to pull a little money to make it official in the eyes of the state. And the whole the whole family tree thing, in in my eyes, wasn't anything to do with like keeping proper track. It was more over. For example, let's say two people want to get married and it's to find out whether they're like adopted to each other or some shit like that. No, um, yeah, no, no, I get no, it. I agree. Yeah. I'm on board. I think there's yeah. some good ones, especially if they got yeah. money. Yeah. yeah. Oh, absolutely. We, this, like, this is going to be a big money maker for the state. Like, I, yeah. I, I just really, like, I, I, I know I'm passionate about this, but I do also want to just um, mention I have a brother, not blood related. Uh, you know, six years in the fucking making. I'd do anything for the guy. Um, so I'm at the same boat as you, Ada. I completely get it. Um, yeah. he, he's my whole world. And I'd never want to lose that. But at the same time, it's like, he can still be my brother. 
without being like, you know, whatever. You get what I, I'm trying to say. So mm-hmm. maybe maybe yeah. the 25k is to like, you know, we like erase their name from the log. They don't gotta wear the armband or whatever. Yeah, look, th- this family, oh this, this family tree, this tracking shit. This has nothing to do with the one child policy. Nothing. Yeah, it was just Juno... my idea. Yeah, my Aside idea. Side project. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. hundred okay. percent. Um, nothing I'm at all. Fu- yeah, I'm fine with people just paying twenty five k okay. for a little uh, flare certificate. It's fine. But, like uh, like uh, having raw mm-hmm. as a yeah. kid it isn't stops bad. There. It's I, good for raw. I don't care about tracking. I don't care about any kind of legal additions to any of this. It becomes weird. It's a certificate. They because then it doesn't mean anything. It loses. It loses the purpose. Uh. As a member of the PD and uh, a, a sentence at the end stating you there would be a fifty thousand dollar fine for uh, some kind of penal code infraction, like I need to do it in that way. I need to know what that's going to look like and how that's actually going to be enforced. Start adopting five, Adoption six, front? seven, eight, nine, ten people. Yeah. So is that like it sounds like, like weird is that yeah. like if, yeah. if 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 Joe runs adoption? up to Bob and says Why I'm your fake? son but Just they're not there actually isn't related an actual and thing you Susie can do hears it like? Susie runs over to me and then says I heard Joe say to Bob there's nothing that they're official brothers now go right. arrest him and fine him fifty thousand dollars yeah right. I mean he's call it like so it's uh, a fake marriage establishing personal relationships without the government's uh, permission. Look, Nakota, you, you guys do prostitution stings, do adoption stings, man. You'll get yeah. real rich real quick. <laughs> look, look it, 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 there, there's a lot of crimes that kind of rely on that same kind of interaction, you know? Like, uh, you know, you know, hey, I saw this guy selling weed down on, on That's the purpose street, you know? of like, the hey, rule. Go get that that's guy. That's the entire you know, thing. It, it, you have to be dumb to get caught, and that's kind of by design. Yeah. Uh, also, spontaneous utterance could really apply to this as well. True. Yeah, people constantly claiming fam- uh, familial, you know, connection to try and get out of, you know, said charge or whatnot. It's like, oh, are you sure you want to commit to that one? <laughs> yeah, there's a there's a lot of ways we can trip people up and make a lot of money. Uh, also, it, uh, sorry, sorry, go on that. Um, I was thinking about, uh, I was kind of thinking about, um, I think it was Philippa who said, you know, why stop at one? Yeah, um, you farm more money. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. What we could do is we can make a, a kind of like a compounding uh, oh, charge. So like you know, twenty five k for the first one, fifty k for the second Motherfucker. one. Motherfucker. One hundred k for the third one. Fuck. You know what I'm saying? Oh my god. I'm done. Now would this, this be crazy. like this per guy. parent? So like you know, say one person adopts one sibling and the other parent adopts the other one well, do, do we legally recognize marriages i don't think we do right not yet uh that's Wait, something the girls count or is it just boys, <laughs> <laughs> we, just the boys. we really were on the same line of thinking <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. i think uh this would also benefit from a legal definition of adoption formally finally um we could we could include siblings and shit in that particular definition mm-hmm. for the purpose of uh the weird freaks that like to do this shit Hey, uh, that'll, that'll help us cover our backs as well when it comes to actually enforcing this law. Uh, yeah, so just to clarify, this will be the Did most say, highly penalized on, uh, uh, crime you can commit on paper <laughs> financially in the city right now. Good. Nice. Just yeah, don't, it's, it's, it's a sure. terrible just don't fucking problem. Just by, don't by, al- <laughs> by almost double. Uh, <laughs> That's not true. Possessing a PD gun is like 30k. Yeah, oh, no, I know. This is 50, so it's almost double. Uh, sorry, Max. What did you mean by the sibling thing? Did you mean like? Um... Uh, I just, I mean like, alongside and enacting, in theory, if we pass this, and uh, act, enacting a a formal Los Santos definition of what adoption looks like in the eyes of the state, and including okay. siblings in that, because when you adopt someone normally, you're adopting a child or like a someone, you know, that needs the protection of a new family. Whereas here, it's kind of like a. Uh, like a, a way to dap up your homies almost like you know mm-hmm. what i'm saying all right um, i think i've got all the authoritarianism yeah. jokes out of my system um <laughs> uh, don't tempt me um why don't we i think i'll just motion that uh maybe juno and max if you guys want to put together like draft parameters so we could actually have something to review sure um and then we can vote on that like next week Okay. Max, okay. I so am, are you are you are, yeah. are you, in, you interested in uh, the definition of adoption? Like just because uh, the, there's a lot of stuff we're talking about where there's like multiple variables and uh, it's easy in conversation to be like, oh yeah, we could just do it this way and that would work. But I kind of want to see it. You know what I mean to vote on it. 
Sure. Right. Sounds good. Really yeah, I think that'd be it, because it's a, there's a lot of variables involved. So I think it's probably better if we yeah. have something more concrete to go off of. I'd, I'd even yeah, put it in that, that uh, account. Jokes aside, I don't mind that. the idea. I just think uh, we probably need something to review. Yeah, no, me either. We gotta just iron it out a bit. So what, what are you guys Samantha, confused about? Take a look at the art on Spotter uh, review. That looks amazing. Who? Well, yeah, nice. Is anyone confused? Nice. Oh, we are. Uh, nice. You guys. That's a good salute. There you go. <laughs> And yes, I have worked out. I have worked out an arrangement with her, so salute. she will be. <laughs> Crane. Jesus Christ! Okay, thank God you're pointing. What he said? That. Uh, yeah, not a salute. Yeah, it's a disco thing. You're doing like, just the John Travolta. Yeah, yeah, staying alive. You know. Yes. Right, right. Yeah. Uh -huh. I think um, letting I... It, letting people adopt multiple and just having it double up every time is probably the way to go. If you want to make money from this and let people do stupid, but still. You know, mm -hmm. make money from stupid, then I think that's the better option. Yeah, because people are clearly already affected by this. When they've heard about it or they've discussed it with me, they've gotten like uh, upset about it, which means uh, that they will they will absolutely pay yeah. for this. Yes. I mean, yeah, because I, at I, the I, end I, of the day, there are people who genuinely value those connections and those bonds and those relationships. And I mean, mm -hmm. they make us who we are. Uh, Essentially, yeah. um, for the ones I think, who I think the language just needs to be very specific. We need to make sure we mm -hmm. cover all the all the different things we all raised here. You know, siblings and yeah. fucking grandkids, and you know, basically, we're gonna have to penetration test this and come up with every fucking loophole and stupid, clever exception people think they're gonna come up with first. Yeah, yeah. Because exactly. I don't. I'll, I'll be honest with you. Maybe this is just me being lazy. Uh, I don't want to hear fifteen fucking lawsuits about. You know, my I don't have to pay because blah 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 blah. And, you know, we need to make this thing airtight. What do you also, mean, uh, the enforcement? Please make the enforcement as they're all going to sue the government and say I, I shouldn't have to pay because you know this doesn't apply to me and this reason that reason third. Yeah, mm -hmm. and make it a little you know preemptive. Uh, okay. All right. Next meeting then. Hmm. Here. Sounds good. Next. We have Bitch. the Sin Act. The Stop Incest Now Act, or uh, Sin Act, is to prevent the rampant incestuous relationships in Los Santos and return society to a normal state. Dear God, yes, please. Oh, Let me no. share this with you guys real quick. Poor Aaron and Sears, what are they going to do? No, they're not going to get infected. Stop fucking each other. <laughs> yeah, I do leave that. <laughs> uh, oh. Hopefully. Well, they're exempt yeah. government, so sorry. They're exempt, huh? Okay, hold on. That's what it says. Why are they what? exempt? What the hell? I don't, I don't know why they're exempt, but they are. The Fulker exception. Oh my god, they're, they are. <laughs> like they're, the guys, they're not, they're not blood related, guys. I don't see why they should be I mean, chastised they are, for this. I guess. It should what? anyone then? They were other step siblings. Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. So the government. Oh, Crane is going to doesn't ooh. recognize their relationship for the Sin Act, but does recognize their relationship for the purposes of the Family Tree Act. No, well, they wouldn't be related if, uh, if the uh, one child policy went through as is. But I thought you said if you're related by marriage, then it counts. They're not married, yeah, but they're brother and sister under. Aren't they like stepbrother, stepsister? How so are they related? Th th they are related by virtue of the fucking bullshit adoption shit. They're not even related. Oh, wow. so they're related. related. I don't. I don't even know. <laughs> the first thing getting passed. I think then. they've just decided they are. They've, they've adopted each other, so they shouldn't be exempt from the other one. I forget. Yeah. So, oh, so, um, when I first met Sis and Aaron, they were the uh, under the purview of a woman named Avida, and they. Uh, I wanted to schmooze her, and I kind of did a little bit. Not really. Are you uh, Sis's dad? I am his, yeah. uh, as of 10 years ago, yes. Oh. Legally, he's not. He, oh, hasn't, paid the he hasn't paid grand, the money yeah. yet. Well, <laughs> really and guess what? That, yeah. Here's the uh, thing. Uh, uh. Here, here, here's the thing. I have a genuine bond, and Sis makes me a great person, and I, he is a fantastic reflection of myself, and I Aww. would gladly pay $25,000 to make that official. That's sweet. Oh, see? I like what about Aaron? Yeah. Hell no, nah, dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> I, bar I barely know her. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I'm going to bring up the same exact thing as the prior. How do I enforce this? 
for uh, the fifteen hundred dollar fine. Um, am, I, am I breaking into people's related, houses? Why do they need an exception? I'm confused. I don't. I, if if okay, if if Sis is talking about his wood in front of Aaron, then that's fifteen hundred dollars right there. Uh, let let's just forget the exception right now, <laughs> okay? Because it, 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 it sounds like the uh, the one child policy is probably going to go through as soon as it's defined. Which yeah. would make this exception worthless because they wouldn't actually be related. Okay, I'm not okay. Yeah, that makes exceptions sense. Right. Anyway, please, so, yeah. that makes I, okay. Please, let's do okay. that then. Um, we uh, as for enforcement, uh, it, it, it if you see someone making out with their sister, slap them in cuffs. But apart from that, <laughs> like it, it doesn't have to be a an arduous in their home. Well, then the you don't. You open. can't charge them, Nakoda. Okay. Well, it doesn't say that. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we should empower Nakoda to be able to go into people's homes and watch. Maybe. Them. Yeah. I don't yeah. want that <laughs> though. So that uh, they can figure out. Yeah. Like, no, wait, 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 hold on. on. We call it the yeah, LSPD right. Romance Division. <laughs> okay. Um, really and then the subtan could be we like to watch. We can just rename <laughs> uh, IA. It'll be IAC. It'll be uh, Incest Action Committee. There you go. Oh my exactly. God. It's perfect. Bro, what is this? Um, that's what, that's, uh, so essentially the purpose of this fucking law is to outlaw incest. Um, uh, we, we will, we'll, we'll remove the Fulker exception, um, because it doesn't really serve any fucking purpose. Uh, incest, as far as I'm aware, is not illegal currently. Uh, and, uh, how do you guys feel about making it illegal, guys? Oh, wait, okay, I... so hold on. Is incest <laughs> sex or is it making out? Both. That's that, that's it. I count I... making out as incest. I... If you're kissing your sister, I don't think I... that should be allowed. Yeah, I mean, I'd agree, but like, <laughs> where where is the line? Yeah, you like, are you giving it a pass on the? Yeah, what about like an OTPHJ? Like, a kiss on the the cheek, or are we talking like tongue and? Yeah, can I also paint a? Yeah. This is not supposed to be a joke either, despite some of Crane's earlier jokes. Oh. Uh, two people are on a bench and they're uh, making out with each other, and I walk up to them and say, "Let me see your adoption papers." <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Um, can you say it more angrily, <laughs> like more guttural? That's as angry as I get All right. in this scenario. I'm sorry. <laughs> Nicole, sheepishly so tired, asked. Dear. I sheepishly asked out and you have the authority to go up and I, bro. do you see where i'm going with this though you force uh, people to identify themselves reasonable doubt so family that's actually a good thing that we're gonna have to address um okay. namely uh making it legal free or defining the legality of requesting adoption papers i guess um I would like to see that. I don't see why not. The adoption um, paper mandate. Regardless, uh, as is written now. We would make everyone get family crests. And then you could just look on like their Ooh. shoulder. And if the crest match, they can't be made out. <laughs> oh, oh, no. I mean, I don't think that's cool, Christ. TBH. <laughs> no, no, uh, we're not putting crest. labels on no, people. Uh -uh. No, 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 no. Crane, I thought you were done. No, oh my no. god, my oh, eyes. He is on easy. fucking crazy. Family crests are cool, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, like, like a lot of people. 30% of joke. <sighs> Can we put our family crest back at the, at the hospital? No. <laughs> no? Okay. Nick fucked that up. What? It ran better, better back wow. then. That's crazy. Uh, excuse me, I run the place. You don't insult me. <laughs> Hmm. Nick didn't do shit. Oh, okay. God bless. I mean, you you figure out the implementation works. I'm for it, but God bless. Uh, it it's simple. It's simple. We just demand their papers. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I do. Well, as it stands now, um, adoption is not really defined. So I'm gonna work on this, and we'll okay. uh, we'll we'll talk. Uh, well, I'll, I'll bundle this in with uh the uh the the fully defined hidden um, yeah, policy reasonable uh moving on we have and can i just say i'm not trying to uh jam up everything it's just i'm going to be the one at the bench trial when someone takes it to court right and prove it in court <laughs> yeah are you, are you, do you need help figure out how to prove it like i, I don't why you need like, no 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 it's not it's not the proving it i just want to make sure that it's crystal clear for all officers because i won't have a problem <laughs> with uh, being in court, but, you know 
Yeah, not everyone I, is me. Yeah, you know, seventy percent of cops can't read, so it's pretty tough for them ass. to smart ass for really kid. figure that shit out. Uh, it'll be it'll be clear, Dakota. I promised. All right. Uh, we got the uh, the REIT modernization. So we're doing, Act. Are we doing a review of that one with a draft next week? For vote? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. Um, just wanted to float the idea. Uh, we got the uh, the REIT modernization act of 2024. Uh, and I Wait. will share the hmm. <sighs> continue. What are you grumbling about, Crane? When you say of 2024, mm-hmm. isn't this? an act from another jurisdiction uh i think so i think it's inspired by it i don't don't, don't think i don't think it's i don't think it's completely derived from it um all right sorry could you repeat the name of it the oh i'll text you it's r-e-i-t yeah yeah real estate what is it real Uh, estate investment trust oh real estate yeah uh yep. oh, I yeah don't know that's about this one. I'll, I'll hear it i just want to i'm i already have questions and i good old billy oh, boy ask you your question what, what you want you to tell us about it first yeah please please well i mean i mean you guys clearly fucking know about it so i mean <laughs> let's hear the question i, I, well, I, I'll, I I'll know just what say for my is, purposes but... i literally just lambasted a couple lawyers today for you know, citing to Brady on the docket and things like that. So I just, I would feel like a little bit of a hypocrite if we passed a, you know, yeah, paraphrase of an act from another yeah. jurisdiction. Mm-hmm. That's why I want uh, our ding, ding, of ding privacy down. laws to be very different if we do them. Okay. What is, how is it, is it like simplified? Like what's the Law content? Goes, it's been 20 months. Is just uh, the name I... similar or is it literally just the act but transcribed? I have no fucking clue. I did not even know about this prior to, uh, you know, really talking about it and figuring out uh, what we should do with this. Essentially, uh, as far as no. I'm aware, it's going to be the bring, brought up as one of the last purpose things. of something. Does, does this sound like someone is moving constantly above us? By the way, no. You guys no. hear that shit? I think so. You don't no, hear no. that. You don't hear no, people no, no, walking hear around. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. I, uh, no. Maybe I was just I don't, don't know think what I do. I, I, I hear but it. I didn't hear it. But it's I also me. hear gunshots sometimes, and nobody else does. And no, no, no. Someone, uh, it definitely oh. sounds like someone's on the roof. I have rest as uh, Lex. Oh, yeah, that's Michael. Oh yeah, okay. it's fucking Michael. Yeah, it's how he's sitting. <laughs> oh, oh uh, yeah, okay, that. that's fine. Um, so the uh, the notes on this are simple. This is to enable affordable housing through real estate investment, specifically rent to own, where the only Ding to the state is ensuring these kinds of trust are tax free. However, the long term benefit to state What's comes. Trust? No, it's the What's way trust? when you sit like that. Yeah. You have like you move your legs around. Like, Whatever. I don't. Bouncing. I don't fucking know. So the rhetorical oh, point I'm making is that the problem with imputing acts from other jurisdictions is that they often use legal terms that are well defined through decades and decades Give of jurisprudence. Like, I'm gonna put something over. And so when you start doing that, for example, we don't have trust in this jurisdiction. So yeah. right away, we'd have to define what a trust is. Okay, which then uh, opens up to legally how do you open a trust? Well, and who the, can, the, you know, this what this wasn't the uh, the actual uh, writing in the uh, proposal. This okay. is, these are more notes that I, I have written. Um, instead of trust, we could just write the word thing. It doesn't really matter. Okay, cool. Yeah, I mean, I just I want to make sure we're you know able to back up whatever we're saying. Yeah, uh, it, to ensure this kind of thing is tax free. However, the long-term benefit to the state comes from the asset fees. The tenant turned owner will then be able to pay to the state, which they would not have been able to afford otherwise. Mm. Uh, that that is the purpose of the REIT. Um, so basically, it's allowing an entity to buy up properties. So we're subsidizing then... slumlords. Yeah. Yeah. Essentially, uh, I don't like this Yikes. at all. Yeah. Uh, no, w- because what's why to not? stop? What's to stop a group of people from? pooling money together, buying up literally all of the properties, and then price gouging mm-hmm. everybody and forcing them to rent from them forever. I'll be honest, and they get tax break. Happening. And had, they get a tax Mr. break, which we simply can't I, uh, afford right now. I had now. Mr. K come up to me and pitch to me in the hospital that this legislation had already been passed, so I was oh. kind of expecting this, so that's crazy already. 
Oh, and he Wait. was pitching. Oh yeah, he chat. was pitching to me and uh, my husband Fraser uh, that <laughs> that we should get in on this because it's already tax free because of legislation. Yes, there are mm-hmm. groups of people that yeah. are he, already wait, doing this. Was, hold yeah. on, was he consulted in developing this legislation? No. So how? Why would he know that? I don't fucking know. Yeah, I don't. I don't know either. Um, uh, he, uh, he's already taken lots yeah. of money from people and bought properties yes. and th- those people have not seen any profits yet so yeah uh but i Wait, what are the, oh there, is this a CT... has to be if this was even entertained there would have to be a limit on how many properties they could purchase CT uh there would have to be a specified uh time limit as to when that house would be sold they is... can't own that what indefinitely because it that's yeah. quite literally what would happen that a group like a of scam. people would yeah. pool all their money together they would buy up all of the properties and everybody would be forced to rent from them at forever <laughs> So as, yeah. as far as I'm aware, uh, as far as I've heard, because I'm aware that this is happening, they're operating a rent to own program, which adds a small overall. Um, like, I think the number that was quoted to me was like 100,000 above the asking price of the house. Uh, but what these people would get in return is the ability to move out of the government subsidized housing uh, to live in an apartment, to be able to store things in their apartment, to sleep in a bed that isn't in a jail cell sized apartment room. Um, and it, the the trade off is that, first of all, uh, they don't have to have $500,000 to buy a house immediately. One. Two, uh, they are able to pay it instead smaller rent um, per uh, fee or charges or whatever. So they'd be, they'd be paying rent, obviously. Uh, and three, um, it, it it is a rent to own program, right? So eventually they would own that house, courtesy. So of, how, you know. how much is so... the tax on 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 property purchases? Uh, right now it is thirty percent. Twenty four. It was dropped. Well, so wouldn't they you be dropped losing it to money? Twenty four. Yeah, we would be. We we can't afford. Oh wait, the the ta- the tax changes went in. Yeah, they did. I forgot oh, to mention okay. that. Sorry. Oh uh, shit! Cool. It well, happened as we were discussing mm-hmm. earlier. Sick. I- um, one thing as well, uh, because I'll be honest, this has been pitched to me a few oh, times by yeah. Mr. K and Associates, uh, is that they're renting these homes to numerous people. So you say this is rent to own, but to who? They're, they're literally pitching it as roommates so that you can move out of the apartments. So how does that... And then there's going to be a fight to who's going to own it. Well, no, but it doesn't yes. even make sense because... Yeah. If you're if the house is 500k, it makes sense and you're because paying they're giving people the opportunity to get a piece. Right, that's and... that's what 75k in tax. Shit, mm-hmm. but that is also just and so who's gonna mess. enforce? If, the, if you know... the profit margin is only 100k, you're only making 25k on a 500 thousand dollar investment. It's free money though, right? But does that also take into account the increase in property value the more houses that are purchased? Because mm-hmm. usually, not to I'm mention, not... I'm sorry, go ahead, Nakoda. Well, no, no, my only thing was I'm not like an economics major or anything, but aren't REITs usually contingent on interest rates? And I don't think we really have those. And there's no there's no way to enforce uh, like I, I know for certain that the people who have invested in these properties are not getting any kind of money back. So who enforces that? Uh, Is that money taxed? Is the rent taxed, um, you know? Uh, no. Look, I'm, I'm just gonna say I'm gonna say flat out. Uh, yeah. I kind of, I'm almost at the point of tuning out the rest of the discussion until I figure out how the fuck Mr. K is aware of legislation that none of us were even aware of till it was brought here, and is so yeah, confident that, that it's gonna be passed that he's spouting off to one of the board members about how it's already guaranteed. Yeah, it's clear yeah. he didn't know who I was. The moment I said it, he backtracked a bit and was like, "Well, no, it's something that's gonna be discussed." Um, but he pitched it to me before knowing who I was as something Ooh. that was already. Did, did anyone else help you guys craft this, Max? Um, yeah, my lawyer, Siobhan. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, we should probably talk to Siobhan then and figure out what's going on. True. Cool. Um, I mean, all of this information and stuff is public, though, right? So, what would be the issue with someone in the public knowing about this previously? Well, you, said they, you said they didn't. Who? You. Well, apparently he fucking does. I didn't say he didn't. Oh, well, yeah, right. So I'm saying if Siobhan is oh. uh, creating, I guess, legislation suggestions for you, 
and involving people who are in that market who will profit who from are it then greatly. profiting that's from it bias. that's yeah. probably not great and they already own property as well conflict yeah. and yeah are already doing this then yeah that's just so yeah. what, what do you what do you guys no, hold, well, on, hold, on, hold getting... on hold on hold on crane what are you guys going to do about the problem right now though because what it problem? is a problem the, the, they own the properties. They're going to buy all of them. What are you guys going to do about that? Does this stop them from doing it? This just no. gives them tax it, it, cuts it, it, if they do. It gives us the ability to afford cheap housing opportunities for well, people who on. otherwise do not have... Ha what problem? You just stated the problem is what? how do we stop them from buying all the properties? And then you said the solution is that it gives us the ability to... No, I was responding out? to Philippa. Well, I was responding problem, to something Philippa said. The problem with the fact that uh, you're stating that they're buying up all the property? So Does basically... Just incentivize them to do so? What? That's what it sounded like with what Mr. K was saying to me. I don't know what Mr. K said to you. Uh, he pretty much said that, uh, that getting in on this is clever because it won't be taxed anymore because of the legislation. I don't even know if it's taxed anyway. So wait, he wants he wants you to invest in what his business scheme? Uh yeah, he was just trying to pitch that we should get in on renting a property. His uh, he made a pitch to me just like weeks ago. Uh, he didn't mention anything about this re thing to me, but like I said, this was weeks ago. But essentially, you are buying uh, <sighs> like a percentage of the duck. house, right? So like I, yes. I I I I give him. You know, uh, let, let's say a hundred thousand dollars, and this gets me twenty percent of the house he purchased, and then therefore I get twenty percent of the rental income that comes in, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, but well, what's I got to a guarantee suggestion. that you'll get Go that on. money. Uh, I think that we should uh, consider implementing legislation that deals with disclosures uh, by members of the board. Because if we're going to propose legislation, I think we need to be clear about how involved we are with it. Because at this point, I don't know if Siavon's fucking Max, uh, involved with the, the way business. he sits He's just in the dark on with board his glasses. With it. He looks like uh, I don't know what, but I'd like to know. Uh, and legally, I don't know how to get that information. Are you, are you basically suggesting that when we propose legislation, there has to be like you know maybe a disclaimer that you know isn't public if it gets voted in but just filled with us like who has like seen this or helped crafted it well, before i mean yeah. because literally in the in the the mm, qualifications like to be on the city before, council like legislation one of the things like, that we wrote in there glowing glasses literally like says the anime. well who's we uh the federal government the interim and, mayor and you correct okay go on so and again when you guys signed up to run for this you accepted these conditions Mm -hmm. It was on the, the sign up on the government website that you're accepting the conditions of the memorandum establishing the city council. And one of the parts in that uh, piece of legislation of the expectations of the city council and its members is that I have no formal allegiance to any other government agencies mm -hmm. and or special interest groups, which would prevent me from acting in the best interest of the city. Are you of allowed Los to have Santos. opinions? Sure. So if people opinion, are going to have business investments or ties to business investors that would sway or bias their participation on the council and or the crafting of legislation <laughs> then that's a problem that needs to be disclosed what's the uh, what's the uh, the proper uh protocol for disclosing that i don't know we'd have to establish that here i i you know i well, didn't what, think that it would what, be a problem because i thought that you know everyone sort of agreed with the policies they just need to be uh, well, what do you propose? Gosh. Uh, maybe public figures on the council should have to disclose their investment portfolio. I mean, that's how it works in other jurisdictions is okay. you hold people accountable by public figures have to disclose when they Ooh, sell or buy stocks, nice, invest in businesses, etc. so that their decision making is an influence. Yeah, I don't think that should be allowed. So how, like, uh, so I'll be, I'm, I'm perfectly fine with full disclosure. So the, the reason that I know so much about this is because uh, my boyfriend uh, has been one of the people to invest in one of Mr. K's properties. So, but I have not. So, but that's how I know. Like, for example, I'm, all my money is in Ron Oil. 
So I wouldn't Same. come here trying Ditto. to, you know, yep. suggest legislation about oil regulation because I'm not kidding. I got two hundred dollars in the bank. And the rest of my net worth is tied up in Ron Oil stock. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, how, much, so. in Ron. how much money you got in Ron right now? Uh, I don't have that much. I, my portfolio is like twenty three, twenty four thousand. Yeah, I got four thousand in Ron. I've I've actually bought so much Ron Oil, and I've been disappointed every fucking time. I, well, I bought I bought the dips. Like, I, dude, yeah, yeah if it goes below uh, ninety, you buy. It goes tr- below, yeah. above a hundred. Yeah, is Trav the are averaged around 87. I was going to say, is Trav the only 90, person that knows how the, the stock market is tied? It's about 40 but anyway, uh, no I, I, this I is just something that I hadn't really... Ain't no way Nathan doesn't know. Uh, ...pondered before, because I, you know, I didn't think about... I mean, when I wrote it, I wrote special interest groups in terms of lobbying oh, James and Lee stuff as well. to That's prevent people from James taking Lee. monetary incentives directly yeah. to influence legislation in their votes. But I didn't think about sort of ancillary biases where... People might have pre-existing investments. It just needs to be orange glasses. Those instead. business relationships. Oh, he he kind of had to the face the too. Influence that allows legislation to be selected or cultivated. Yeah. Okay, so your guys' concern with the rate stuff is that one, it does not, um, it isn't entirely unique. Uh, mm-hmm. Two, uh, you don't want slum lords to rule Los Santos. Although, side note, they are currently ruling Los Santos. Uh, yeah, I and, think we should probably regulate them as opposed to enabling them. Uh, I'm for, I'm for yeah, that. I'll figure it out as well. I it's think not that, hard. For example, uh, when you I know, you know. Oh, one thing we, we could do is limit the amount of properties that any one entity can. Oh, own. I can't see it anymore. So, yes. for example, instead of person, just say entity, and therefore, uh, you know, it would prevent. What is my a, a company from I am too buying sold out a bunch of residential to even have an opinion on this right now? I don't even know exactly. what it entitles. Entails. Uh, well, well, let's get on that ship, bro. Yeah. They they got and a lot of property. Have, they can't. Yeah, have so like I'm gonna. I'm, uh, so let's do this. I will. Uh, I'll add to my list to draft something related to disclosures for the council. Is there something that actually drives the stock market uh, in the game? And then, um, can I assist you with that one, Crane? Yeah, yeah, that'd be helpful. Okay. Why don't Why don't Why don't you take point on the disclosures? Yeah. Um, and then I'll uh I'll start looking into how we could regulate them. Um, I need to talk to people who know about what's been going on with Mr. K. I didn't realize it was that widespread. I'd heard little things like I knew, I knew PD went like, you know, if you look up the, they split look a up house the or whatever, but I didn't numbers. know it was, uh, yeah, I have had sexual emails being rented to me by four yeah. different people. Uh, they were constantly coming to Mr. K. everyone all the time. The police own a house that he owns or they yeah. rent a house. That yeah, he they, owns. they rent a house. They don't own it. And they're paying in well, what I would describe as an outrageous amount. Well, some of the investors are cops. Yeah. As, so. as, as far as disclosure, so I could start uh, spitballing together a, a rough idea. Are we saying investment portfolios slash business relationships you may have? Yeah, I think that'd be fair. Yeah. I'm just curious also, and I'm, again, if anyone knows more about this than I do, please let me know. Uh, those are, REITs are typically run... In con- like by a business entity, right? And as far as we're aware, there's no recognized businesses in the city, right? Exactly. That's the other thing I'm concerned about is, yep. uh, so if 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 this conglomerate is buying up houses and then creating tenant relationships, we don't even have fucking tenant laws. Yep. So what happens if a tenant sues and says that the landlord isn't holding up their end of the responsibility? What is the landlord even defined as? Mm-hmm. Where's the oversight? Regulation. And once again, this is why I'm loath to introduce sweeping concepts because now we got a can of worms of defining yeah. an entire fucking concept of landlord tenant law. Oh, well, yeah. that's something that we should be willing to do, though. I agree. I'm just, you know, it's a lot to know that it just exists already before we've even had a chance to discuss it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, and I, I'd, I'd wonder, I'd have to, I guess we'd have to get a look at a contract. Maybe we'll ask one of the PD who is invested in one of these houses and get a look at how it's written. And... Tonight. Yeah, that'd be helpful. Yep. Was Kate looking at my... Okay. Uh, well, I don't feel comfortable bringing that one to a vote. No, uh, not at all. Yeah, I wouldn't vote on it. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah probably scenario. best. Yeah. Uh, okay. Next is the... Real quick, because we're still on a similar subject, we mentioned entities and houses. Are we want to at least put a stopgap on it right now so it doesn't get worse? Yeah. 
uh, we gotta prepare so something can... for a vote. Yeah, I don't even know what we'd be voting on necessarily. We'd have to, we have to delay it till next week. I got we gotta have time to at least write some shit up. All right. Yeah. Investigate, see what the contracts are like. I don't want to go blind. I want to go bet. <laughs> okay. Um, the next thing I wish to discuss 